Okay, this is my avatar that I made a few weeks ago and I used him in the videos. So I have sent Ben Soup here an invitation to join the UC Davis group. So let's just see where that invitation goes to. Have a look down in the corner there, Benj. See that number one? If you've had more than one message, you'll see a lot more. Um, I think I have like 75 because I haven't logged in on one account, and there'll be 75 messages there. So this message says, um, notifications, HVX Silverstar has invited you to join a group. There is no contact, no cost, sorry. There is no cost to join this group. So I'm going to click on that to open it. So I just clicked here in the screen and it opened it, like on the message. And I'm going to join it. You have been added to the group. So that message disappeared now because I've joined it. So if by chance I dismissed it or deleted it, click the X and deleted it, then I would have to get another invitation from someone to invite me. But right now I'm in the group. So I'm just going to look in here. You can open up this panel. When you open up the panel, your um, IMs, like if someone sends you an instant message or um, asks if you want to join a group, they will show up along the lower bottom here. So because the now we've got this panel taking up that most of the space, so it just moves along anything. So that little message that said one would actually now be sitting down here. Okay, so. Okay, so I'm logging back in to take a look at my messages. My, that's my kitty. My other avatar has sent me, let's see, a few messages here. I'm going to look at the lower right side. The first one is a notification. So this is where you'll get your notifications. Um, it's If you're asked to join the group, the Davis group, it, w it will be there. Uh, in this case, I I have another um, notification saying that um, there's a landmark attached to a message, so I'm going to click on it. And it says it's from HVX Silverstar, so that's my other avatar um, from the UC Davis group. Um, getting to Davis Island using the landmark. And the landmark is attached to this message, so if we just click on it, it's right below. It's called Med Projects, Davis, then the coordinates for the location. If we click on that, it will actually take us directly to the um, landing point where our class will be. Okay, that there are actually two islands, and the Med Projects Davis is part of Davis Island. So I want to click on that. And here it is. So by clicking on it and opening up the landmark, it actually added the uh, landmark to my folder. So it will now be, if I look inside my, my landmarks is here, and this is the landmark, I can teleport directly from there by clicking teleport. Let's do that actually. And here I am on the platform. Everything is still resing. You can see here the rocks starting to come in. Uh -huh. So depending on your computer and what your graphics are set to, um, it take a, a long time or a short while for that to for those graphics to come in for you. Okay, so here I am. So we teleported using the landmark, okay? We click on landmark. Let me get back here. These are all of my landmarks for this avatar. So it's the globe and landmarks, Med Projects Davis. I actually have two. That's because I sent myself one, plus I also um, received one from the UC Davis group. When I clicked on it to open it, it put it into my landmarks. I can look at the next tab, the teleport history, to show where I've been. You know, so I've been to this Castle Valeria, which is where I went when I first made the avatar after the orientation. Then right now I've come to Med Projects. Okay, let me look also in here down further at the suitcase is my inventory. Again, I've got lots of things in here. One of these sections here is 
landmarks. That's another way of looking at your landmarks. Okay, I can also get to it from the globe, so landmarks to get places. Uh, note you can walk through here and find a destination guide, the world map, and you know, just by clicking on it, reading through it, you can learn something. I can see um, friends that are nearby. All of my friends, I only have one friend, I made this friend um, at uh, the, the first place I stopped after the orientation. I can look at this person. You see, click on I. So she's been on for three months. And if I want to send her an instant message, I could click. And I could, you know, send, write something in here and she would receive it. Okay, and we used the instant message when we were talking to each other um, on the the first place I, I started on the, I think it was called um, Caval Island or something, it was a castle island. And I could also, if I wanted to at this point, if I wanted her to come to where I was, I could click the teleport and it would offer her, join me in Davis. You know, it would offer her um, an opportunity to be teleported right to where I am, except that she doesn't belong to the UC Davis group, so it wouldn't work for her. But this is how I could, um, if I was friends with one of you, this I was friends with one of you, I could um, teleport them. I'm actually going to, let me see here, I'm going to go up to communicate and go to my friends. Okay, and so I don't have very many friends. Um, my groups, just UC Davis, and recent HVX Silver Star was recently here. So I think that's, and that's true, that was me, I logged in. Now let me look down at this bottom here. Um, I'll close that. So three are the three messages that I have. Looks like I have a conversation going on with my other avatar. Let me click. HVX Silver Star is offering you friendship. Would you be my friend? Accept. And the next message was um, that she's given you the Med Projects Davis um, landmark. That's why there are two in my inventory. Um, I received one in the message from the group, and then I received one because she gave me one. Okay, and again, I could show it, and it's going to open it up for me here. If I want to use it, I'll just double click on it. And I'm actually already here, so it won't work, but it will pretend it's working. There we go. And I'm here. Okay, so I just wanted to show you that. This is where you look for your bundles of messages. If someone has IM'd you while you're off, it'll show up there. And when you come in, I'd like you to take a look at the second tour's landmark. In here, if we click on it, we can actually take a copy of all of these links by clicking on Give Note Links and it'll keep it, puts it into my inventory. Or I could have just clicked on any one to go to those places. Let's go to my inventory, it's the suitcase. And I can look at recent, and I'll see that I recently got this folder. This is the, the Med Project landmark, and then this. Let me open it. Inside that are various landmarks for um, places that I'd suggest that we visit the Ann Myers Medical Center, Breast Cancer Awareness Garden, um, let's see, the, a nursing um, sim, also here near this island, um, Virtual Hallucinations, which is on the adjacent island, and Virtual Ability, another for people with disabilities, and a counseling clinic, Life Choices. So we could just click on any of these. If we would like to go there, let's click on Life Choices. And that'll be how you make your way around. So people can give you landmarks, you can go using the map, you can click on a place, you could use the, um, the visitor guide, so you could travel around that way. Let's see what we're... I think 
this sim has changed. I don't know. I don't think it is life choices counseling anymore. Let me search and see if that's why that happened. Life choices counseling clinic. Here it is. It comes up in the search. Let me click on that. So I can join the group. I think I will. Now I'm a member of the group. Um, let me see if I can find something else out about it. on their advertisement here. Life Choices Counseling Service. Athothica Community Philosophy Art Sciences Education Clemson University. Oh, so it's in a different spot now. So it has moved. So let's see if we can get to that. So we need to go to Athothica Community. <coughs> 